What games have you literally spent months of your life playing? World of Warcraft The factory must grow. Minecraft is probably one of the few games I played for months. RuneScape Pokemon Asking my wife where she wants to go eat. The Sims Tony Hawk's Pro Skater Chess I've been playing for years and I'm still rated potato. Civilian V Diolo 2 Warcraft 3 That game was my obsession for years. Campaigns, ladder play, making custom maps, good times. 5000 hours Counter-Strike Go Been playing CS since I was 14 in 1999. Back then, CS was a free add-on when you purchased Half-Life. Instead of Steam IDs, there were 1 IDs. I had a 5-digit 1 ID 94830. Been playing that game with the same group of buds ever since. Edit so many OGs I'll see you all in MIRC Find Scrim, Cal M only. Stardew Valley Face with Tears of Joy Face with Tears of Joy. Oblivion. Morrowind as a kid for sure. Skyrim. Magic the Gathering. Starcraft. Plants vs. Zombies. Kota and Kota 2. The Elder Scrolls 3 Morrow in 2002's I spent 8 years playing until my Xbox burnt out and I was forced to move on to Oblivion, by the Skyrim was about to come out. The first fable for the original Xbox. Grand Theft Auto V was also entertaining. Binding of Isaac and Slay the Spire. Final Fantasy XI and then XIV. Dungeons and Dragons. Rocket League, I have 2,700 hours into that game. Although recently it's been getting harder to play. AoE 2. You can now play it on Xbox and I'm hooked all over again. World of Warcraft. Oh wait you said months, not years. Fallout 4. Team Fortress 2. Have 2,154 hours on there, which equates to almost three months. Path of Exile The Sims I have more than 16k hours of playtime from Sims 4 alone. Free Cell Dota 2 Animal Crossing New Horizons Pokemon Go I started playing the week it came out, not knowing anything about the Pokemon franchise. I play off and on pretty much all day long, every day. Sitting at level 50 with over 600,000 Pokemon caught and over 500 million XP. Zelda Bo TW and Top K. Civilian. Noita. Starcraft. Start to play around 1998-1999 play for a couple years. Come back to it when StarCraft 2 come out at 2010 and still playing to this day. My son takes over my accounts now so play time is limited. The Witcher 3. I've been through it three times and did everything the second and third time. I discovered it five years ago just after my son was born and I had loads of time I stayed home to raise him. Now that I am back at work I couldn't put that kind of time in if I wanted to, it the timing worked out well. Skyrim. COD 4. COD 5. The entirety of the Halo franchise minus anything Halo 5 and beyond. Random assortment of Flash games. Probably Halo 2, definitely Halo 1 3 combined. EVE Online. League of Legends. That game is free to play, but will literally cost your soul. Bop 635 hours. Next is Yu-Gi-Oh Master Duel for 350 hours. Dark Souls 1 and Borderlands 2. In the past World of Warcraft, Rift, Path of Exile. Currently Warframe. Beat Saber. 
Destiny 2. Horizon Zero Dawn and The Witcher 3. Overwatch. Max Payne. Starcraft. Stardew Valley. As every other 2000s kid it's definitely Minecraft. Skyrim and Stardew Valley. There's literally so much to do. Mario Kart. Doom. Castle Wolfenstein. Oregon Trail and it was approved by teachers' parents. OSRS. No Man's Sky. Literal Open Universe. Rollercoaster Tycoon PC Edition. I don't normally play games ever just here and there and randomly, but Rollercoaster Tycoon is a problem for me had to put it down or it would consume me. Dwarf Fortress. WoW, EverQuest, EverQuest 2, every Elder Scrolls game starting with Arena, Civilian 6, Stellaris, M002, Gal Civilian 2 and 3. Think that's it. EverQuest. Kingdom Hearts. Deep Rock Galactic. Ultima Online. Clash of Clans. Wow Years. Poker. Years. Call of Duty. DD Since the Red Box Basic Edition, too many hours to even begin to count. Oblivion My family members all have several thousands of hours each. Fallout 76 My wife and I each have several years of playing nothing but. GTA 5 and before Forza but I've gotten into GTA a whole lot including playing the story mode I haven't finished. The story mode in GTA 5 and 4 are the best. Halo 1, 2, 3, ODST, Codbo 2, 3, MW 1, 2, 3. I have 8k hours in Rust and 14k hours in League of Legends. There was a time I played Rust for around 9 hours a day for 3 years straight. I've been playing League since day 0. Dishonored and Skyrim. Tears of the Kingdom. I picked up and next thing I knew 3 months of my life was gone. Skyrim, the Kesson and Dynasty Warriors series and COD Zombies. EverQuest, WoW, Diolo 2, Lawn Mowing Simulator, Cyberpunk 2077. Nearly 4,700 hours on record in Steam, not including offline, and not including multiplayer. Purchased the game exactly 8 years ago today. Uncharted and Mass Effect. Sims is up there too. Final Fantasy XI. How has nobody mentioned RimWorld yet? Currently Baldur's Gate 3. I've spent 90 hours in Act 1. World of Warcraft, Magic the Gathering, Rivals of the Void, Anwu Bochi. War Thunder still grinding Leopard 2 PL. Solitaire. Settlers of Caton. Overwatch. I'm still mediocre. Command and Conquer Red Alert Online and MW2COD. Super Smash Bros. Melee. Months? Try years. GTA 5 and Sims 3 4. Tetris. The Sims. Sudoku. Skyrim. Golf. Between Skyrim and Fallout I think I could have done another college degree by now. Resident Evil series.